Hi there. Happy Saturday. It's a long weekend here in the Bahamas, which is fantastic. Um, I wanted to hop on because today, yet again, someone said to me, how is that possible? And I've heard that uh, said to me I don't know how many times in the last 20-25 years and what caused that response is this early this morning I had a lucid dream and in the dream I was back on Grand Bahama you know and I used to live on Grand Bahama I was there for some years and I left in 2016 I think but anyway in the dream I was back on Grand Bahama and I was at the home of a friend who used to be the financial manager at the school where I worked. So I was with her and her husband, and I was also with her daughter, Sabrina, and her fiance. And Sabrina is a lovely young woman. I actually taught her, I think from 2006, five or six through to when she graduated in 2009 and I haven't seen her since and I really haven't kept up to speed with what she's been doing so anyway it was really lovely to see her in the dream with her parents and with her fiance and they were all the whole family was very excited because they were telling me that they were planning Sabrina's wedding and they were sharing the details. So when I woke up this morning, I went on to Instagram because I seemed to remember that um, Sabrina and I had connected on Instagram a few years ago. So I found her on Instagram and then I sent Sabrina a private message and said, hey, guess what? I had a lucid dream of you and you were this morning and you were very excited I was at your home with your parents and your fiance and you were planning your wedding. So Sabrina wrote back to me and said, oh my God, that is so weird. I can't believe that, it's crazy. She said, yes, they had been at her mom and dad's home because they were planning the wedding and they were getting married next Saturday. So uh, Sabrina and I, you know, were chatting back and forth. And again, she just kept saying, wow, that's so amazing. That's so amazing. Uh, you know, it's crazy. It's weird. It's wild and all of those things. And um, she was excited. So why am I sharing this? Well, I'm sharing this to say that because this kind of comment has come up, you know, and been said to me many, many, many times over the last, I don't know how many years, I honestly don't know what to say other than it is grace. You know, the mind could never wrap itself around any of these kinds of um, experiences at all. The mind could never conceive or control or manage that kind of um, connection. And in many cases, it is too much for the mind to figure out. And it's really all to do with grace. It's to do with the awakening of the spiritual energy, the flow and the connectedness of all of life, the recognition of the one self, and the truth of the one as evidenced in this very beautiful and very intimate encounter and discussion and meeting I had with Sabrina and her family early this morning. And Sabrina did go on to say that, you know, that they had decided on a very small wedding, just very, very close um, members of the family were going because of the situation. And they wanted to ensure that her grandparents were safe. So they were just having this, this, this small group. So I said, well, I'm very happy and very, you know, honored to have been able to be a part of the conversation about the upcoming wedding and I wished her all the best. So I, again, I'm sharing all of this to say that 
This is the truth of the one, the one in the many and the many in the one. That is the true reality, that is the true awareness. And once grace starts to move through your life, then these kinds of incredible experience experiences begin to manifest. So I share this with you with much, much love. As always, if you would like to leave a comment, please feel free to do so below. And you can find me on Instagram at Julie Hoyle Official. And you can, you can also find me on the Adjata Casa app where I'm hosting an amazing group, Awake Now What? So be well, be happy, keep shining bright. Look for these amazing synchronicities and the messages that are always, always, you know, showing up in your life and take note. Be present, be well, and I send you much love. Bye for now.